Great privation is a play about grave robbing and how it uh, affects the uh, present day descendants and as well as the perpetrators of this practice. It is a beautiful, lyrical, wonderful piece about a mother and daughter in 1830s guarding or standing vigil over the recently deceased patriarch's grave so that people won't come and dig his body up for medical research. The commodification of black bodies where you know we're undervalued, seemingly undervalued in life but then we become of great value in death um, in a way that doesn't quite um, benefit us directly or immediately. An awakening of what reality is for black people in that time and also it's a way of her connecting with her mother that is explored and it's real. You see the real life issues that mothers and daughters have to deal with. It's not all flowery. There are beautiful moments but there are also real moments that are authentic. I am so excited to, to explore this very specific black mother and daughter mm. relationship which is explored in both time periods. For modern day, for Charity, it's her connecting to her lineage. Like some of the questions that she's asking her mother is literally the same questions I'm asking my parents. Yeah, we'll see whether or not she finds out. The one thing that connects us is our history. It's the weight of the play, the stories and topics it's tackling are so heavy and so deep and so real. How um, medical apartheid has impacted our world today. We tackle so many topics within black culture, black American culture. We're also and doing it on this really beautiful, intimate and tiny, wonderful stage, which is a privilege because it means we get to reach everyone in the audience, but they also can see everything. Um, I think the audience will be thinking, wow, that play has had me question um, my perception of medicine, my perception of the past as well as the present and how deeply connected they are to their own ancestors. This definitely happened and also it shows the remnants of what th things have happened in the past and how it affects people in this day and age.